Hello, Woodshop. Uh, happy th Thursday. Yeah, Thursday. Uh, so on Tuesday, I had you just watch a video with uh, Nick Offerman and his shop. And the idea is just to kind of get an insight into what other people have besides us. Now, granted, that's a Hollywood actor uh, who started as a carpenter and then became an actor. I got thinking, like, where do I want to go with this? Because I thought, you know, maybe we should explore, like, what are some of the possibilities of their career choices? The reality of it is probably not a lot. I mean, yes, there's home building, that type of carpentry, but that's more construction. Uh, there's stuff like the trim work and that behind me, the mill work. But again, that's a very small select. There's a lot of stuff in the timber industry in this state. But again, all real small niches. I gotta stop yawning. I worked my butt off today. Um, so, I don't want to do that. I mean, eventually, yes, I do want to explore industry, but not today. So what I figured to do today, Thursday, is that why don't we go ahead. And a few of you have sent me some pictures, or even I've seen a small snippet video that somebody sent me of what they've done so far since we've been off of school. What have you done? What have you done with these? What have you built? Uh, you have to have done something. And I'm not saying it necessarily has to be a woodshop project. It could be in metal. It could be, hey, I baked this. I kind of would like to see like a small like one-minute video of, hey, McMullen, here's what I'm working on right now. Um, I've had a student send me pictures of a guitar that he built. Uh, another student sent me some pictures of this little tractor that they welded out of just random things. What have you done? Have you done nothing? I hope not. That That's, I hope not. You've had to have done something, help a parent out with maybe a chore around the house. What have you done? So there'll be multiple ways to turn in this assignment. The easiest would be take a couple pictures, give me a description, email it to me or, you know, reply with this Google assignment. Uh, you could make a small video, like one minute long. I'm not looking for a half hour of you ranting and raving. If you want to do that, sure, go for it. If, if it takes a half hour, oh, uh, Reese Martindale sent me pictures of a boat he pulled out of like the back 40 and is restoring. So I know people are working on different things. Uh, some of our seniors may actually be physically working in an actual job part-time. Uh, I know I seen Nick Hippensteel and Blake Amy a few days ago along with uh, Alex Yoakum, and I know like Nick and Amy are, are working like the 9-to-5 job, which is awesome. So what are you doing? What are you doing to stay active, keep your mind busy? Uh, what are you building? What, what What's that craft or hobby? Again, it doesn't have to be metal shop related. It could also be like, you know, baking. I, I've made homemade hamburger buns. We've made loaves of bread, rye bread. There really isn't pizza dough. There hasn't been much I haven't made yet. Uh, and that's just normally me too. We do a lot of canning. In fact, uh, I'll spin the camera around right now with me. Hey, look it. It's a whole bunch of maple syrup that I just bottled up. So what are you doing? So you can make me a video. Hey, McMullen, I don't have really good internet. Okay. Uh, you know, take some pictures of that project you're working on and send them through Remind. Uh, McMullen, I don't have the ability at all to make, to take photos. Well, then you're going to be writing me at least a minimum of a page description of what you've been doing one specific thing. And, you know, I'm not going to share. If, if you want me to share them, I, maybe I'll throw them up on Mr. McMullen's Facebook, but I, I don't plan on sharing these with anybody. What are you working on? Uh, I know I heard from another young lady that she's refinishing a, uh, I believe it was an entertainment center or a nightstand with her mom. Awesome. Send me a, you know, give me a picture, a little bit of, you know, a written description. I'll have the assignment posted in, in Google Classroom as well. But what are you working on? Think about it. There has to be something. I hope you're just not sitting there playing video games the whole time. That's, it's, it's fun to play video games. Yeah, but. You got to get your mind out, you know, a little bit and actually do something. Um, McMullen, I haven't done anything. I really have just done absolutely nothing. Okay, well, 
I can work with you on that. I want you to be able to complete this assignment. Uh, education is extremely important. I, I'm going to tell you number one is education. So what can we have you do? In that case, if you have not built, constructed, created a hobby, something to to better yourself over uh, the quarantine time, what could you build right now? Give me three quarters of a page. I'll, again, I'll give you a description in, Google, in the assignment. But give me, you know, three quarters to a page of what could you possibly do with what you have at home and what's available to you. Potential. And if you say, there's nothing I can do, I don't buy it. There's always something that can be done. Have a great Thursday. Enjoy your weekend. Remember, you've got one week, one week to complete this assignment. Uh, no more. My suggestion, just knock it out today. Get it done with. Have some fun with it. Be creative. Uh, again, if you got any questions, get a hold of me. I know a few students have said, I don't understand your assignments. That's okay. You can all, you know, if you're not understanding it, message me through uh, Remind and we can set up a Zoom meeting and I'll walk you through it. Something tells me it's just easier for you to say, I don't understand how to do it than to actually do it. But maybe I'm wrong, and I hope I am. With that being said, have yourself a wonderful weekend. Stay safe. Stay home. Uh, make something over the weekend. Make dinner from scratch. Send me a, you know, some pictures of it. I like food. There's a reason I'm not skinny, and I take up the whole screen. Take care.